Chris 6 News at Noon continues. Well, good afternoon. What month is this? Yes, it is still October. It's hard to believe it and how it feels outside. That wind has been awfully cold this morning. And a live look here from our CCRV weather bug. You can see it's 51 now. That sunshine's helping us out, warming it up. Uh, with a 15 mile an hour wind. We dropped to 42 this morning in Corpus Christi, so it's nice to see those temperatures coming up a little, but that wind is still cold. And at the Waves Resort, a live look, you can see a few high clouds in the distance, although there's plenty of sunshine and a chilly wind blowing in 51 degrees right now. As around the region, you can see those winds continue to be pretty uh, breezy out there. We've got 15 to 22 mile an hour winds. You probably heard some of those stronger gusts last night and early this morning. Well. The breeze is gradually going to subside today. Good news there because that'll help us out and how it feels. But you can see on Future Tracker here this afternoon at 2 o'clock, we still have those rather breezy conditions, 13 to 18 mile an hour winds. But those do start to die down as we get into the trick or treat hours this evening. The coast right along the beaches will still be a little breezy, but all in all, those winds really coming down inland as we go through the night, nearly calm. So we'll look at your day planner today. Just keep the jacket handy. You're going to need it. It's cool all day. And as we get into 6 o'clock this evening, that temperature at 56. But of course, once that sun sets, those temperatures are going to drop. And for trick-or-treaters, well, yeah, that coat will probably be needed unless they've got a pretty warm costume. Those temperatures this evening are going to drop down to 48 degrees by 10 o'clock, but the winds will be subsiding and it'll be clear out there. So at least we're not dealing with rain here for the trick-or-treat hours. That's good news. But look at these lows tonight. Now, the record low tonight in Corpus Christi is 39. We're going to get close to that. We drop down to 40 in Corpus Christi tonight, 36 at George West tonight, 38 Alice. It is just going to be cold out there and even at the beaches in the low to mid 40s with our clear sky. So we have that colder air that's feeding in behind that strong cold front that came through yesterday. Higher pressure continues to build right now and that's going to gradually shift away from us the next couple of days and that'll warm us up a little bit. However, our next weaker front, this one right here, that's going to come in Saturday. Not going to do much for our temperatures, but it will shift our winds around again. Speaking of which, here's Future Tracker, and you can see this is starting tomorrow morning. We pick up a few clouds tomorrow as the winds shift back around to the east. But as we get into Saturday, that next cold front drops in here, shifting our winds back around, and we end up on Saturday with a... Uh, a few clouds and temperatures staying rather mild right through the weekend. We'll start to see rain chances return as another front returns uh, to the area next Tuesday and Wednesday. So the weekend is looking mild with cool nights and lots of sunshine. Here is a look at your NEC Co-op Energy 7-day forecast then. You can see the temperatures slowly rise. We're up to near 70 by the time Saturday and Sunday roll around during the day. Still well below average. Nights stay cool and then we warm up to near 81 by Tuesday. All right, thank you for that, Sharon.